the framework for responsible research and innovation in ICT project, FRICT. Imagine interacting with your very own robot. You're preparing breakfast in the kitchen one morning, and in comes the robot. Good morning, it says with a smile. Morning, you say grumpily. It looks at your face, tunes into the tone of your voice, notices smoke rising above the stove, and hears you slam a pot into the sink. Quickly, the robot works out that you are not having a good morning at all. Because this robot is an emotionally aware robot, it can change its behaviour according to what it notices about you. It can guess your mood from your posture, your tone of voice, the colour of your face, your heart rate or breathing pattern. The information helps it interact with you in a more natural way. So if you're having a bad morning, it can avoid upsetting you further and can even try to make you feel better. This kind of robot is an example of an effective device. Effective devices are designed to perceive, interpret or express emotions like we humans do. But while there are benefits to this kind of technology, there are serious considerations too. Like where does the robot store your emotional profile and who has access to it? Insurance companies? Drug companies? Future employers? And what if the robot becomes so good at expressing and responding to human emotions that it confuses people? What if people begin to treat the robot like it's a fellow person? And how would we feel if these systems misinterpreted our behaviours? Would we feel deceived? How would this affect our sense of control over the technologies that play a part in our daily lives? Our work explores how we can make innovations in digital technologies that are mindful of the consequences for individuals and society. To do this, designers of technology should make their best efforts to anticipate the consequences of their innovations, reflect upon the problem they're trying to solve, engage with all those who have an interest or are affected by the innovation, and act to ensure the innovation is socially desirable. By studying the positive and negative impacts of computing devices and factoring them into the design process for future innovations, research communities become more accountable both to those that fund their work and to the public in general.